My name is Charlie Ashton. I'm responsible for business development for Wind Rivers Networking Solutions. And we're here today in our mobile technology briefing center, otherwise known as our big rig, which is essentially a large truck, which we take to various customers and customer sites and various events you know, around North America. And today we have our truck parked on the exhibit hall at uh, the big telecom event here in Chicago. And we've come to this event primarily to talk to customers about our solution for telecom infrastructure. That solution goes by the name of Titanium Server. And it's a software product that runs on standard server hardware and enables virtualized network functions to run with the level of reliability that is required for telecom networks. So over here we have a demo that we've been showing to, to various customers over the past few days where we demonstrate the, the operation of Titanium Server. We show how it, it maintains the uptime of carrier services you know, through situations where, for example, a, f a server might fail or the virtual network function itself might fail. And through the architecture of Titanium Server, we're able to recover from those failures so they're invisible to the end customer. So Titanium Server is a product that we introduced to the market a little over a year ago now, and it, and it solves some very critical problems for telecom infrastructure, and in particular for the telecom service providers. The first problem it solves for them is how they're going to maintain their revenue stream as they transition from, typical, from traditional physical equipment to the virtualized infrastructure that is what NFE is really all about or network functions virtualization is all about. The service providers are concerned that as they make that transition they're going to be introducing new virtualized applications into their network and there's a good possibility that the overall reliability of their infrastructure will degrade. And that's a problem because they all have contracts with their enterprise customers that mandate a certain level of uptime. So there's actually a risk that their revenues could go down as a result of paying out penalties unless they're able to maintain service reliability. And through the technology in Titanium Server, we maintain that level of service uptime for the service providers. So let's just take a minute and we'll talk about the architecture of the Titanium Server product. Um, Titanium Server is based on open source software elements. Firstly, carrier grade Linux. Secondly, KVM, which is an industry standard hypervisor, and we've actually enhanced KVM with a couple of enhancements that are required in order to maintain the performance and the reliability that you need for telecom infrastructure. Thirdly, Titanium Server comprises a, a, or contains a carrier grade accelerated vSwitch. We looked at some of the standard um, virtual switches that are available, such as the open source, open vSwitch. They don't really provide the performance or the features that you need for telecom infrastructure. So we developed our own very high performance accelerated vSwitch based around the Intel DPDK software library. Next, um, Titanium Server uses a standard OpenStack distribution. Um, and then we implement a number of high reliability um, and performance features through OpenStack plugins. The fact that we, avail we implement them through plugins allows us to quickly pull new versions of OpenStack as they become available in the community and then apply those plugins to that, to that latest version. So everything that you see within this red rectangle here is the Titanium Server product. It runs on standard server platforms based on multi-core Intel architecture hardware and it supports virtual networking functions coming from a variety of companies that we have partnered with. Um, we actually work with them at an engineering level to make sure that their software runs correctly and runs optimally on Titanium Server. Very importantly in terms of the flexibility that service providers are looking for, Titanium Server supports virtual network functions that run on any guest OS. That significantly increases the pool of available VNFs that the service provider can select from in their overall deployment. And then finally, Titanium Server interfaces through standard APIs to service orchestra orchestrators and also to the OSS BSS solutions that are a key part of a, of a, of a network deployment.